there's one quick idea I want to share with you on when you use a qualifying post and if you use it with an image or without an image. When it's your regular Facebook profile, you can ask questions like, how does it feel to have your nails manicured? How many times a day do you apply lipstick? Where is it to you frequently carry a bag? All those kind of questions. Use those without an image and occasionally use an image and just show some fun product. If you have a VIP group, a Facebook page, people know if they're there, they're going to be advertised to. So feel free and put pictures there. So let me give you a couple ideas of what to do when you've been showing good content, you've been given lots of ideas, you're asking good engaging questions. What do you do when somebody contacts you? One of the things that's really important to understand is when somebody says, hey, tell me more about that product or tell me more about your business. Often what they really are saying is, I want to know more information. And often if they say, I, tell me how to order that or tell me how to, you'd get going, we assume that they're ready to close the deal. But often they want more information. So one of the things that we don't want to do is instantly send our website, tell them about all the product information we can think of, tell them our story. What we want to do instead is say, thank you for contacting me. I want to give you the information you need. Can I ask you a couple quick questions first? That's when you go into asking simply, hey, what sparked your curiosity today? What made you contact me? Um, tell me what the post was or what inspired you to reach out to me. From there, you can say, tell me more about the person you are shopping for. If the reason was they contacted you was this product seemed to be a good fit for a gift. Ask them about that person or about the person you're directly talking to, more about their interests, their hobbies, their challenges, when it deals with your product and reveal more needs, show more interest, and that will build trust. The last thing you want to do is just like every other time we get the opportunity to talk about our product that we first, before we start giving a whole lot of information, just ask permission. May I share a few ideas with you that have worked for others? When you do that, it creates a little bit of a referral and it also shows that you respect their time and their interest and you want to make sure that these are the things that are important to them. It'll build trust and a lot more sales. Go get them. Have some fun.